Did you get a new baby today? Mm-hmm. Can you tell can you tell us what you're doing to your baby? Uh the baby turns out into a, it it's first it's a ball and then when you put it in hot water, um it starts opening. Yeah. What kind of animal is it gonna be? The kitty cat. Oh, it's a kitty cat. What's her name? I'm gonna name her Olivia. Lucy! Olivia? Yeah, Olivia. No, what Lucy. Is... Okay, let's blow dry. I'm really happy about getting this kitty cat because it sounds cute, it looks cute, and its eyes have glitter in them. Congratulations. Trader Joe's, I have arrived. My favorite place to go in New Orleans. Well, one of them. I honestly love coming to New Orleans. There's a lot of things in here that I would consider my favorite. Um, it's a little bit different this year with COVID because look at this line. I've got to go jump in line. And I don't know how fast this line's gonna move. If you're ever in New Orleans, Trader Joe's is the best place you can go. Mommy loves, I love the gluten, gluten free uh, treats at Trader Joe's. So when you come to New Orleans, one place that you must come to to get donuts is District Donuts. And that's where we've come today to do our last full day of being here in New Orleans because we go home tomorrow and we stopped at District. It's one of our favorite places. It's one of our favorite places to get donuts and Raphael and the kids are in there right now picking out which donut they want. Um, obviously, it's something that I used to do before going gluten-free, but they don't have any gluten-free donuts in there, so I'm not eating here because that would really mess my stomach up. Um, there have been a couple of days that I have ordered stuff that I thought obviously would not have gluten in it and come to find out just by my body telling me later on that evening that I made the wrong choice. I shouldn't have ordered that item because it did have some sort of flour or it was cooked near wheat or flour or something because it did cause a reaction later on in the evening in the way of um, TMI. A lot of gas, a lot of bloating, a lot of discomfort, a lot of cramping, all that stuff. Those are typical signs that I have whenever I eat gluten or too much dairy um, and then also I, I tend to swell too like I my ring my wedding ring I know with the inflammation if I can't spin my ring then I know okay I have a problem I you know ate something that maybe I shouldn't have and I don't have just to be clear with this whole going gluten-free thing I don't have a gluten allergy that I've been diagnosed with like celiac I just 
at the age that I am at now, which is a grown woman, I'm able to listen to my body, eat intuitively, and be able to identify things that cause me discomfort when I put them into my mouth. So, um, little things like that, triggers like that, remind me that, hey, going gluten-free, that was a good decision, and this is what happens when you eat things that have gluten in them, you feel really uncomfortable. Whether I eat them knowingly or whether, whether I eat them unknowingly, my body still lets me know. Okay, Aria, what kind of donut did you get? A chocolate one. Chocolate? Quentin, what kind of donut did you get? Chocolate. Chocolate with sprinkles? And Henry, what kind did you get? A jelly. Uh, uh, jelly sweet. with powdered it's, sugar? Yeah, it's a donut with filled with strawberry jelly. And, and seasonal jelly. Oh, seasonal jelly. Okay, yeah, cool. So and Daddy, what kind of donut did you get? What is this one called? Christmas cookie butter. Wow. And some coffee too. That coffee looks good. It's a Vietnamese iced coffee. Nice cookie. Very nice. So I forgot to mention that the Velvet Cactus is also one of our favorite restaurants. And look at this beautiful setup that they have right here at the front of the restaurant with lights and reindeer and a sleigh. Do they have a snow machine going? I saw snow coming out. Let's, let's wait and see if it'll pump again. My brothers and I made it on the nice list. Mr. Bingo! So, you know how, did you, did you guys see your name on the nice list? Yeah! Oh my goodness, you should have heard my car. You should have heard them in my car. They're like, what? And, and Henry goes, Henry goes, I've been bad all year, but I've made it on the list anyway. <laughs> have you seen your name? Whoa. So. <laughs> I knew when we do that, that was so no, fun. No, it's on your bottom. Quentin, what are we doing? Riding the train. Are they about to go before we do? Are you having fun, Henry? Yeah. Aria, right, are you hanging out with Granny? Yeah. Granny hey, said she's tired, but you want to send me on her last so <laughs> Uh -huh. Mommy and Daddy made it on the naughty list, but we still had fun at the park. If you're ever in New Orleans in the wintertime, Celebration of the Oaks 
at City Park is a great family fun activity. Thank you guys for watching all of our New Orleans vlogs with us and enjoying them. If you like the content, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like.